Hey, Final Line fans, and welcome to this week's edition of The Eye. I'm your host, Marissa Sulek. And before we wrap things up for the year, let's take a look at this week's Illini Rewind. On Tuesday, Illinois baseball won against SIU, and this could not have been done without sophomore Ben Troike, making him our Prairie Farms Performer of the Week. Last season, he reached base in 44 games, which is the longest active streak in the Big Ten. But last night, in the bottom of the fifth, Troike reached base for the 45th time this season, breaking his own record. With the year coming to a close, there's a lot to celebrate here at Illinois Athletics. Sammy McQueen has this year's top five moments. Hey Illini fans, it's been a great year full of exciting achievements in Illinois athletics. Let's take a look at the top five moments of the 2017 to 2018 season. Starting with the men's basketball annual bragging rights game against the Missouri Tigers. The Illini took their fifth consecutive bragging rights victory, winning 70 to 64. After posting a 14.5, Alex Diab is the 2018 Still Rings National Champion. Diab became the 50th individual national champion in school history and the third to do so on rings. 2017 was a big year for wrestler redshirt senior Isaiah Martinez. Martinez won his third Big Ten title and was the NCAA championship runner-up, finishing with a nearly undefeated record. Martinez will also continue his international career with IRTC here at the University of Illinois. Illinois Volleyball had a huge upset win over Washington to take them to the Sweet 16. The team finished with a record of 23-11 and 11 and 12-8 and eight in the Big Ten, which scored them fifth place in the conference and a bid to the NCAA tournament. John Davis became the 498th American to run a sub four minute mile. At three minutes and 58 seconds, his time ranked first in the NCAA Division I and set a new Illinois program record and a new Army facility record that stood for 44 years. Can't wait to see all the great moments in next year's season. Thanks for a great year, Illini. Marissa, back to you. After the break, we get to know an Illinois sprinter on the men's track and field team. It's hard not to be a fan of a credit card that gives you more while saving you money every single day. The Illini Visa Rewards Card, available only through U of I Community Credit Union. Men's track and field is preparing for next weekend's Big Ten Outdoor Championship at Bloomington. Tommy Figgles in the studio with this week's athlete profile. Thanks, Marissa. As we reach the end of the year, it's important to remember that athletes aren't just athletes, but students as well. Joey Hates on the men's track and field team seems to have mastered both. Hate graduated from Warren High School, where he still holds the school's record times in 200 meter and the 4x200. Now being in his third year here at Illinois, he's beginning to make his mark again. As of this year, Haight has won the 200 and 400 meter races at the Illinois Twilight, as well as scoring seventh overall at the Big Ten Championships in the 400 meter. But it isn't just his athletic achievements that caught our eye. Most recently, Haight was awarded an OSCE for his Outstanding Scholar Athlete Achievement. He received a 3.94 average GPA this year in engineering physics an award only one men's athlete receives in his grade. We're wishing you the best of luck in your finals, Joe, and all athletes for that matter. Marissa, back to you. Although the school year is coming to a close, there's still a lot of action happening here in Champaign. 
Lauren Mraz is here with your Illini preview. Thanks, Marissa. Illinois athletics as a whole is not too busy this week, but for those teams who are competing, there is a lot on the line. Let's check out what's happening in this week's Illini preview. Illinois softball is at home this weekend against Nebraska. The Illini will play at 5 p.m. on Friday at Eichelberger Field, followed by the fan favorite world's largest softball tailgate and a 1 o'clock game on Saturday. The series finale will be at noon on Sunday. It is the team's last regular season series before the Big Ten Tournament in Madison, Wisconsin next weekend. The Illini baseball team is also at home this weekend against Ohio State. The Illini will play at 6 p.m. on Friday. Then again at 3 on Saturday with that series finale starting at 1 on Sunday. Both the Illini and the Buckeyes are fighting for an NCAA tournament bid and could remain in the race for the Big Ten title. Illinois sits in fourth place at the Big Ten standings, just one game ahead of sixth place Ohio State. Illinois women's golf will head to its second consecutive NCAA regional this weekend. The Illini are headed to Madison, Wisconsin as the fifth seed in their sixth NCAA appearance in school. That's it for this week's preview. Back to you, Marissa. That's all for this week's edition of The Eye. Make sure to check FightingIllini.com for more inside looks at Illinois athletics.